So today's the day I'm going to start on the LC. I have a lot to do to it, a lot of plans, a lot in mind. So this is the last time you're gonna see the LC sitting like this. So let's get started. First thing on my list, uh, let's get this thing on jack stands. So uh, let's get it up in the air, get it going. Got the LC on the jack stands behind me, and it's time to get started. I think I'm going to start with refinishing the brake calipers. Um, this is how I do it. This is how I've always done it. I've never had any issues with them chipping, flaking, peeling. I've never had any issues with the way I'm about to do it. So if you do it differently, more power to you, but this is how I do it and how I've been doing it for 10 years. So check it out. The wheels are off on this side and uh, we're going to get started. The brake caliper is going to be red, keeping the Lexus logo. Uh, we're going to make them red. And I'll show you the paint that I'm using right now. Here, this is the paint that I'll be using. It's made by Eastwood. It's a 2K gloss um, and they're clear. So that's what I decided to go with this time. All right, so I got everything I need here. Um, these are just what I have, so that's what I'm gonna use. We've got brake cleaner, towel to wipe it off. And this is a sanding wheel that I'll use to scuff the face of it and get the Lexus sign off of it for now. So let's jump into it. We got this side prepped, ready to go, taped off. So, all right, so I'm gonna use the Duplicolor primer. I've used this before. This is a leftover can. I figure I might as well use it. So, it always works good for me. So, we'll jump right into it. There's coat number one. Back going. Got the primer coat done. It's looking pretty good. So we're gonna go ahead and hit it with the paint and get that going. Using the Eastwood paint.
All right, we got everything finished up for tonight. Uh, I'm going to call it for now. I will be back this weekend to finish everything else. So this is where we're at right now. Um, it looks awesome. The paint, it laid great. Um, you know, again, this is how I do it. Some people may say this is the wrong way to do it. Some people may say this is the right way to do it. This is how I do it. So I'm excited to see the finished product. Uh, so we'll get it all finished up this weekend. All right, and we're back. So we got about 24 hours dry time on the calipers. I'm going to go ahead and get the clear coat going, the Eastwood clear coat, and we're going to get the Lexus stickers on the calipers. Taz is here hanging out, and helping so, out. So let's get started. Stickers on before the clear coat. Give it the OEM look. All right, so clear coat is done. I went with three coats. Stickers on there. Everything looks really good. I'm really excited for this and how it's turning out so far. All right, we just wrapped everything up. Done. Really stoked on how this Eastwood paint laid, um, how it cured pretty well every aspect of it. I was very impressed with. I'm excited to see how durable it is over the next few months. But here's the finished product. I am very happy with this. And that's a wrap. The calipers are finished. I'm really stoked with how they turned out. Really stoked with the Eastwood paint. I definitely can recommend that. And I'll throw up a further review once these are completely cured. I'm on the road. And I've been using it for months. Next is uh, coilovers. So hopefully in the next week or two, we'll start on that. <laughs>